Okay, we're given a table. We'd like to use this to answer a couple questions. Now it's important to note how they define this. They say Q equals G of N from the beginning here. So as we're trying to evaluate G of three, notice that three is being input into the function. It's inside the set of parentheses. So that's a value for N. So in this case, for part A, what we're gonna be looking at is we're trying to find where is three for a value for N, we're looking at the top of this table, that first row. So in this case, we can say, well, three gets associated with seven as being an output. So we'd say G of three equals seven. Now on the other half of this, we wanna be a little bit careful on part B that G of N equals six. So six is not an input value. It's not inside the parentheses replacing the N. It's actually G of N equals six. And by how they define this, remember Q equals G of N. So what we have here is we're looking at the bottom row of this table, trying to pick out where do we have six and what input value goes along with that output value. So as you can see, six actually occurs a couple times as an output value, which is okay, it's still gonna be a function, but we would say that goes along with an N value of two and an N value of four, looking just above here on our table. So I hope that helps out. This also means that G of two equals six and G of four equals six. All right, good luck on these.